Now, the round ball wrap on KEZI 9 News. Welcome back, welcome back. 4A, 3A, 2A, 1A. Yeah, we teased it before yeah, the break, so we might right. as well give the people what they want, right? We start Cottage Grove Junction City in this one. Landon Colburn at the end of the first half and gets this bucket right here. Drives all the way to the 10. That's how you do it, Mr. Colburn. And Riley Sangermano picked it up in the third. Sangermano in the original Italian means walking bucket. Right, Andrew? Can yes, you attest sir. to that? Tigers win a close one, 66-63. And Philomath takes down Sisters here. Final score, 40-18 in the boys' game. All right, and then on the boys' 4A Sky M side, Sayuslav beats Elmira 49-38, while Marist beats Marshfield 73-65. Shout out to my guy at Junction City. I told you I'd get you on TV somehow. Senior night over at JCHS on the girls' side. We open things up in the first. First shot, no good, but Ciara Thompson on her senior night taking care of a little bit of business against Cottage Grove. Gets the bucket to go, but the Lions had their own weapons down low as well. Maddie Ladd putting it away with ease. Lions undefeated in league play. They beat Junction 37-24. All right, let's go to some 4A3 Oregon West Conference scores. We're still waiting on this Philomath one, which could be a big one because Warriors are still undefeated, of course, this season. Over in the Sky M League, same situation for Sayusla and Elmira, still waiting on scores. Maris got the win over Marshfield, however, 53-38. Out to Barn at Pleasant Hill, sir. 3A play, like you said, Pleasant Hill. Billy's hosting, or playing host to Harrisburg. Second quarter, Max Smith out to Amar Rupnauer. He hits the three from the top of the key. Pleasant Hill trailing 20-8 after that. Later, Tyler Thompson kicks it out to Kyle Davis. Dish and kick, drains the corner three. Eagles up 17, but Harrisburg not finished. Thompson taking matters into his own hands, gets to the cut for the lane. Eagles get the win on the road, big time, 48-38. And this Sanyam Christian Lapine boys score. We're still waiting on a final here. Moving on, Sutherland takes down Douglas, 65-38. Brookings Harbor takes down South Umpqua by 10. All right, so let's take it out to Monroe. Dragon Girls hosting East Lynn over at the Lair. We open things up. With Ashley Sutton getting the rock inside, putting it away, we got the ref's good side too. Every game we ever go to, every ref always says, get my good side. Well, we got all of your good sides, Can't guys. Don't Can't worry. Confirm. On Cedar night, of course, this was a really good night for the Monroe Dragons. They win this one 62-25. In the girls' 3A4 Mountain Valley Conference, Pleasant Hill beats Harrisburg 42-35. Sandy M. Christian holds off Lapine 39-37. In the Far West League, South Umqua falls to Brookings Harbor 59-37, while Sutherland handles Douglas again 59-43. We got a couple more to roll through. Oakland beats Lowell 41-39. Central Lynn over at the Cobra Dome gets a win 35-24. And then the last one we got in this grouping, Oak Ridge beats Jefferson 41-39. Sir, roll us out. And this is one of my favorite venues. I think one of yours too, Andrew. The Cobra Dome. Love Central Cobra Lynn Dome. taking on Regis. Love Look at Cobra. that. Love the Cobra Dome. We pick it up right here. Lane Jepson on senior night. Knocks it down. Rams had a response of their own offensively, though. It'll be Byron Bishop. Matches three for threes right here. Gets the three to go. Shooter's night in the snake pit. Ryan Rowland, the freshman, sang the national anthem before the game. He's seeing three pointers right there. 55 37, the final Central Lynn rolls. And here we go. Oakland takes down low 88 54. Eastland Monroe still waiting for our final of that boys game. And Reedsport takes down Myrtle Point 75 66. Toledo takes down Coquille 68 56. Days Creek New Hope Christian still waiting on a final score there. North Douglas and Riddle still also waiting on a final score. That no, just North, happens to be our graphic. That's it always no, puts no, no, up that's, 57. Well, the funny thing is, that's the typo on my end. North Douglas got that win. I just had to run out here. Sorry. It happens. The girls 1A4 <laughs> Skyline League in Kala Falls to Pacific Powers 36 28. Still waiting on one last score. Days Creek New Hope Christian. The North Douglas girls also got a big win 76 to 24.